Good morning, church. My name is Rob Heinrichs, and I am one of the worship leaders at Eagle Ridge Bible Fellowship. We are a community of faith that normally meets in Coquitlam, BC. But right now, we are doing virtual services to keep one another safe. The theme for today's worship is reconciliation. Our God is a God of reconciliation. Jesus is the ultimate example of reconciliation, and he calls us to follow in his footsteps. This morning's call to worship comes from 2 Corinthians 5, 16 to 19. Here's what it says. So from now on, we regard no one from a worldly point of view. Though we once regarded Christ in this way, we do so no longer. Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, the new creation has come. The old has gone, the new is here. All of this is from God, who reconciled us to himself through Christ and gave us the ministry of reconciliation, that God was reconciling the world to himself in Christ, not counting people's sins against them. And he has committed to us the message of reconciliation. Join me as we sing. He's our rescuer. He's our rescuer. We are free from sin forevermore. Oh, how sweet the sound. Oh, how grace abounds. We will praise the Lord, our rescuer. There is good news for the captives, good news for the shame, good news for the one who walked away. There is good news for the doubter, the one religion failed, for the good Lord has come to seek and save. He's our rescuer, he's our rescuer. We are free from sin forevermore. Oh, how sweet the sound. Oh, how grace abounds. We will praise the Lord, our rescuer. He is beauty for the blind man, riches for the poor, friendship for the one the world ignores. Is pasture for the weary, rest for those who strive. Oh, the good Lord is the way, the truth, the life. Yes, the good Lord is the way, the truth, the life. He's our rescuer. He's our rescuer. We are free from sin. How sweet the sound, oh how grace abounds, we will praise the Lord our rescuer. So come and be chainless, come and be fearless, come to the foot of Calvary, oh there is redemption for every affliction. Here at the foot of Calvary So come and be chainless Come and be fearless Come to the foot of Calvary Well there is redemption For every affliction Here at the foot of Calvary He's our rescuer, he's our rescuer, we are free from sin forevermore. Oh, how sweet the sound, oh, how grace abounds, we will praise the Lord, our rescuer, we will praise the Lord, our rescuer. 
In this morning's sermon, Pastor David will be preaching on Philippians 4, 1 to 3, and looking at the key ingredients for resolving conflict. In Isaiah 9, the prophet Isaiah foretells the coming of the Messiah, Jesus, and calls him the Prince of Peace. Jesus' life and ministry were intended to bring about peace, and our work as the church is to continue this work of peacemaking. The next song is all about the lengths to which God goes to reconcile with us, to make peace with us. It makes me think about the lengths to which I am willing to go for the sake of resolving conflict with others and with my God. Join me. Let's sing. Finally, in this last song, we want to declare our praise for the God who loved us so much that he was willing to give up everything for us. Yeah. 
Thank you for joining us in worship this morning. I hope that your day is filled with the peace of Christ and that you will bring that peace into our world, which so desperately needs it. Have a great week. Peace be with you.